Hey everyone, welcome back to another Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door Let's Play. I'm JY Tino here, and without any further ado, let's get on with the Let's Play. Alright, as we left off, we got one of our crystal stars, we found the location to a new crystal star, and now we're going to look for one of those little weird small guys to continue on. I believe it was this way. Oh, actually, I think I forgot to do one thing. All right, come on, Coops. Let's go. I have to say, we want to make our partner even stronger. So to do that, there's a little place over here with the Shine Sprite. We're just going to walk in here and give this guy our Shine Sprites to upgrade one of our party members. Welcome to the home of Merlin, the Super Magician. I foresaw your arrival. I can aid you if you wish. With three Shine Sprites, I can power up your partners. Of course, that means I boost their attack power, but I also throw in a new move for free. So, which partner would you like me to power up? It's gotta be Coops. Coops is my bro. Shall I power up this partner? Absolutely. Shazibi! Shazubi! Whoa, out of this world. That's right, Coops. Get this power up. You deserve it. Oh, look at that face. Determination. Oh, then we go. Alright, as you notice, his health went up by five points. His attack power is going to be stronger, and he learned a new move. All right, back in the sewers. Let's continue on. All right. Let's go this way. And I missed it. All right. Now we're going... Okay, we gotta wait. Oh, see you later, Coops. All right, there we go. Oh, boy. So much backtracking into the sewer. This sewer is just... Ugh, I don't even know. I'm just, I'm just saying nonsense. All right, we'll go this way. And there we go, into the pipe. And out of the pipe. Oh, there it goes. Hey, Mario, you see that? That was one of those things Professor Frankly mentioned. Yep, so let's follow it. There we go. We got you now. Mm -hmm. Eek! Don't eat me! Huh? Oh, you didn't come to eat me? And you're not bullies? Of course. Well, yeah, of course not. We're not gonna be mean. For real? Phew. Boy, that's good. I thought for a second I might have an accident. Um, aren't you one of the creatures from Bodley Woods? Why are you down here? What? Why do you know about me? No! You must be... You guys are working for those x knots aren't you? You chased me here! No! It's the end! x knots What the heck are those? Sounds like tissues to the extreme or something. Look, we're not here to do anything to you, so relax. Tell us what's going on, okay? Well, okay. This gang of bad guys who call themselves x knots came to where I live. They came inside our great tree and started tearing it apart and causing trouble. So, I've come all this way here looking for help. A bunch of bad guys in the great tree? If those are the same guys who kidnapped the princess, they want the crystal star. Now that you mention it, they did say something about some crystal star thingy. But we punies don't know anything about any crystals or stars. Say, can you guys help us out? Maybe chase them off? If you do, we'll give you, uh... What was it? The Crystal Star! If we do, we'll, we'll have the Puny Elder give you that! I don't know what it is, but if it'll help us reclaim our tree, I'm sure the Elder will agree. So what do you say? Let's not waste any more time. I'm begging you! Really? You aren't joking? You'll do it? Um, I guess we should. I'd feel pretty bad if we didn't do anything. Plus, we do need to get the Crystal Star before those X guys do. Oh, thank you so much! This is great! I'm so happy! My name is Punio. Pleased to meet you. I'll take you to where I live. Follow me, okay? It's this way! Alright, well, 
Let's uh, follow the puny. I want that badge. But I'll find some way to get it. Wait, hang on a second. Alright, I guess we'll just wait here. I'm sure the puny elders said some button around here opened the secret entrance. Aha! That's an interesting button. Well, let's go follow the puny. Ta-da! We did it. You can get into the woods we punies live in by going through that pipe there. Okay, hurry, hurry! Alright, let's do it. Oh, I missed the pipe. Okay, what? Oh, here we go. Chapter 2! The Great Boggly Tree. Ooh, really pretty. Such a lot of detail in the woods. Boggly Woods. So, the Boggly Woods, huh? Looks mysterious, alright. What will we run into next? Um, okay, just a bit further, and we should be able to get, uh, we should be able to see the great tree. The elder and her friends are waiting for us there. Oh, and my little sister, too. Come on, let's go. Alright, let's do it. Man, this place is beautiful to look, uh-oh. <laughs> Time to go to work, lovelies. Vivian, you understand what we've got to do, yes? Mm-hmm. Find that Mario guy and steal the map to the Crystal Stars, right? We can just do away with Mario and his friends, can't we? Or is that bad? Oh, bad things happen all the time, Vivian. But you're right about our goals. If my information is correct, Mario should be coming down this road quite soon. You must ambush him here and get that map. Hmm? What's this now? Vivian, what's that you're fawning over there? Oh, what? You mean this? I found it near that tree over there a while back. Isn't it a gorgeous necklace? It was so lovely, I just had to pick it up. Hmm, Vivian, for shame! Picking up someone's scraps! Disgusting! Greedy! But enough about that. Vivian, my dear pack rat, bring out the sketch of that Mario guy you got from Gronus. Mwehehe! <laughs> Eep! What? I, I don't have that! You said it was way too important, so you took it. You should have it. Don't be ridiculous. I don't have that thing. You are in charge of it. You wretched little worm. Blaming me for something you probably screwed up. But I... Yeah, I don't know what's going on. G -g oh, what is it, Marilyn? Huh? What's that? A mustachioed fellow? There is no time for such nonsense, you great oaf. Save your games for later. Now, now, where was I? You, Vivian, don't tell me you lost our precious sketch. But, listen, I... Look, it's not my fault. I never had the sketch. Silence, you dits! Such impudence! How dare you talk back to me like some rebellious child! It's clear to me that the only rationale for your type understand is force. That was mean. For your punishment, I'll be taking that necklace you found. Yes, so sorry. But, but Beldum, oh, you're horrid. Okay, uh... Sniff, sniff, oh, what am I to do? Uh, guh, guh? What is it, Mr. Mustache? Leave us scram right now. I have no business with you. All right, shoot. I have no business with you either. All right. I mean, I think they're looking for me, but I guess they don't know what I look like. Oh, what am I doing here? Oh, and I remember. I want to bring out Goombella so we can, uh... Because we're going to have some new enemies show up, like this guy. Let's see if I can get the sneak up on him. Ick. Nope. Oh, all right. Well, fair enough. All righty then. Let's uh, switch it up real fast. Goombella, tell us what we're dealing with. Lookity, 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 bow. That's a pale piranha. You know about these guys, the famous piranha plants? 
This colorless subspecies is adapted to bodily woods. Ah, the wonders of nature. Max HP 4, attack is 2, and defense is 0. If you try to jump on them, they'll totally chomp on you. Alright, well, I guess I'll hit him with the hammer. And get out of here! Okay. Whoa! Oh no, the audience! What is that? What? Whoa, we're tiny. Okay, I'm not... Yeah, we're tiny. Tap power has dropped. Well, that's really upsetting. Well, I can still tattle on him. Boom! That's a cleft. A rock-headed jerk with spikes on his noggin. What a rocker. Max HP 2, attack is 2, and defense is 2. That's hard head is a major pain. Fire doesn't hurt it, but other types of items are pretty effective, usually. If nothing seems to work on it, you can always just run. Ooh, mushroom. Aww. Well, I don't have a pal block. And my attack power got decreased. So I hmm. Oh, I know. Let's swap partners, cause Coop should be fine, right? There we go. All right, Coops, hit him with the shell toss. Now instead of doing three, uh, two damage, he does three, cause his power up. But this thing has two defense, so obviously three minus two equals one. All right, come on and block. Coops is such a good partner. All right, Coops, finish him off. Boom! All right, play the music. We're done here. Alrighty then. Onwards. After I get the coins, 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 coins. Delicious. Oh, I see something in the background. Honey syrup. Woo! All right, let's keep on. Whoop! Let's keep on moving. I don't want to fight any of these guys. All right. Oh, ew, we still have the cricket sound. Let's get rid of that cricket sound. Sorry, everyone. I don't want to have to make you listen to crickets all the time. There we go. Perfect. There we go. Back to normal. All right, let's... Oh. There, can you see it? That big tree? Nope, which one? That's what I was telling you about. That's where my punies live. That's home. Uh, of course, it's not just us in that tree. Lots of jabbies and piters, too. Well, anyway, Mario, follow me. Okay, I think you're just making up names. Jabbies and blah blah. Oh, wait. Coupon. You got an in coupon. Mario likes to, you know, he likes to be financially successful and look for deals whenever he can. As we all should. Learn a thing from Mario. Save your money. Alright, back to the game. Ooh. Pretty tree effects. The Great Tree. Alright, well, let's get into the Great Tree then. Uh. Oh no, what's the matter? Well, that was Coop's talking. Whoops, Daisy. Uh, well, take a look. This door wasn't here before. Someone just installed it. And I can't open it. I thought I could finally save everyone. I'm a fool. Hey, don't take it so hard. It does look sturdy, though. What do we do now? Uh... Um... Hmm... Um... Got it! Uh, okay. I guess we'll just follow you, then. No, yeah, sure, don't tell me the plan, just walk away. That's cool. That's productive. Long ago, the puny elder told me about I skipped it. I skipped it by mistake. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, everyone. Well, I'm pretty sure he said something that wasn't important, so hopefully we, you can forgive me. We can get in through there. I'm completely sure of it. Um, problem is, I doubt finding it is going to be easy. I mean, it won't be labeled secret entrance. What should we do? Not to be a worry wart, but how in the heck can we find somebody's secret entrance? Well, it's hidden by this invisible thingy. We need to find and remove the thingy. Boy, but removing a normal thingy sounds tough enough, let alone an invisible one. Uh... Oh, got it! Flurry! Surely, Madame, Flurry powers can help us. Flurry is a refined and dignified lady who lives in these woods. 
The Elder says she's a wind spirit who can wield the powers of the air with ease. You see where I'm going with this? She could use her wind power to blow the thingy away. Well, it won't hurt to try. Flurries live in the deepest corner of the woods, so let's head back in the direction we came from. All right, sure, let's do it. Walkie, walkie. Oh man, a lot of walking on this one. A lot of walking in all of them. Mario must be exhausted. Oh, little cutscene. Ah, oh, these woods are the most wonderful in all the world. Yes, indeed. Building a house here was just the finest idea I ever did have. Oh my, yes. This place is so different from the bright flash bulbs of the world I'm used to. Such peace. This negative image of the real world soothes my body and soul. But what's even better is that I, Madame Fleury, grow ever more lovely here. Plus, those squishy, adorable little punies that live in the tree are so nice to me. But I suppose if I stay here too long, I'll begin to crave hustle and bustle before long. Oh, oh my, it's happening even as I speak. Already I feel the need for drama. That moment of exhilaration when the spotlight shines down on the stage on me. Surely I was born to be an actress for the ages. It's settled then, I shall rise again, but before I make my stage come back, I simply must whip my body and mind into shape. I'll just have to put on some makeup and make my beauty even more beautiful. Wait a moment. No! It's gone! Gone, I tell you! My, my! Uh-oh. Well, something's gone. Gone, she tells us. Well, I guess that's Madame Fleury. Let's go find her. And, I guess, help her find what she's missing. Hopefully nothing too important. Oh. If we head straight in this direction, we'll see Fleury's place in no time. Alright, let's do it. Walk, 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 walk. Alright, if I remember... Yeah, okay, yep. Yeah. This is, uh... Whoa! 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 Oh! Uh, uh. Damn! Darn, sorry. Well, what's the daisy? Alright, well, we gotta... Oh! New enemy. Well, let's take care of this guy first. Boom! And now let's switch coops. Let's see. Tactics. Swap partner into Gombella. Okay, that doesn't look good. Um, let's switch out Gombella real fast. Attack. Paddle. What is this thing, Gubella? What is this cloud of electricity in which we are seeing? That's a dark puff. It's basically a tiny mean thunderhead. Max HP is 3, attack is 2, and defense is 0. Sometimes it'll charge itself with electricity. Don't touch it when it does. Youch! You know what I mean, right? Brrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
There we go. Do -do 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 -do. Perfect time for a level up, everyone. Good job. Okay, let's see. I don't take a lot of damage. Do I want more flower points to do more abilities? Or do I want to increase my bad points? Well, I feel like I want to do more damage. So, let's increase our flower points. There we go. Use more of our special abilities. Alright, now let's just walk back here. Oh, I want that coin. I want that coin. There we go. And now we're in the background. Where we could perfectly press on this button we saw in the background a little bit earlier. Bonk. There we go. Now we could actually reach the other side. But first, we get the star piece. You got a star piece? Yeah, there we go. We're gonna need those later to buy new badges. Alright, in the pipe. Oh, and a shine. Get it, Coops, get it. You got a shine sprite! Alright, let's fly. And we made it. And let's grab this, whatever this is. What is this? You got a Quake Hammer. Slightly damage all ground enemies. Well, that's pretty good, but we don't have any badge points. Sadly, I guess I got the wrong thing. But it's okay, for next time we'll have that. Or when we get more badge points. Oh, okay. Whoa! Gotcha! Alright, well, that one's gonna stay on the ground, so I'm gonna get the one in the back. There we go. And now, Coops, you can get the one in the front. Gonna a good old shell toss. Uh-oh. Ooh, nice block. Alright, Mario, get rid of this puffball. And we're out of here. Alright. Got us to Oh, I grabbed the coins and went back. Oh, okay. Mistakes were made. There we go. You got a star piece! I knew there was one in that tree. So. Okay, well, there's a lot of uh Look, near in the distance! That's what I was telling you about! Furry's place! Alright, let's uh, turn ourselves into thinness and in this walk through this fence area. And there we go. See you later, Cubes and Puny. This is a oh, Okay, well, welcome back. Well, I guess it's no longer a solo adventure. Alright, we are almost there. And now we can get Madame Flurry to help us. Uh, excuse me. Um, maybe she isn't here. I wonder if she went for a walk in the woods. Um, I'm gonna just go up to her door and ask. Or you ask. Madame Flurry, hello! If you're here, say something! Okay, yeah, I guess she isn't here. Eek! No, out of the question. You mustn't come in here. Oh, no, she's in there. Uh, Madame Flurry, are you there? Is that you? What are you doing? Oh, wait a moment. Those darling, squishy little footsteps. Is that you, Punio? Oh, it's been an age since I saw you last. You poor dear. Is there something you need? Ah, uh, well, the thing is, we have a problem that only you could help us out with, madame. The great tree's entry hole is blocked. There's a stupid door we can't seem to open. My puny friends are inside, so they're in a pickle, and Mario needs these crystal stars. It's a train wreck, really. If you can't find a secret entrance for us, we're done! Oh, is that all, dearie? You came all the way here just for that? My adorable little Punio, you know I'll do anything in my power to help you. However, lamentably, I'm in a bit of a bind myself. I just cannot come out. Gee, is something wrong? It's somewhat embarrassing, but I never go out with my, without my favorite necklace. I just can't find the blessed thing. I suspect I dropped it on my daily constitutional. I'd be simply scandalized if anyone saw me without it, so I shan't be going out. I absolutely must have that necklace to highlight my beauty, and that's that. Gee whiz, that must be some nice necklace, huh? Hang on. You know what? It's weird. I'm sh sure I just heard someone talking about a necklace. I got tongue-tied there for a second. Sorry, everyone. What's that? Do speak up. You, whoever just spoke, do you have some clue as to my necklace's whereabouts? 
If you do, you must help me, please. Be a dear, find it and bring it back to me. If you could, then I'd be delighted to help my squishy little friend, Punio. Don't worry, Madame Flurry. I'm sure Mario can find your necklace. Where it is, he's super. You can do it, right, Mario? Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can totally do it. Great, it's decided then. Let's go find it. I'm sorry to trouble you so. All right, well, we're about running up on that time again. So, you know what? We got a lot done in this episode. We uh, got to talk to Madame Fleury. We missed, met Mr. Punio over here. And uh, we're going to have to go probably uh, back to those Shadow Sirens who have her necklace. But until then, I had fun. I hope you did too. Um, this is JYTino, and I hope to see you guys next time.